Hello YouTube, my name is Trey. Welcome to What Can I Change? You see, I finally backed the camera up a little bit. I know my videos, I thought that the camera was too close, so I finally backed it up. But today we're gonna to be talking about the Island Boys. So uh, you guys may have remember, I showed you this video of them kind of kissing. I showed up, or a similar video to this. And I was, and I said to myself, I said, you know what, this is just publicity. It's not that serious. They're just doing this for OnlyFans. However, things have changed since then. And a video came out, shout out to Dom LaCrae, or LaCur, not sure how you say his name, but it came to my attention that uh, <laughs> these boys are doing a lot more than I had expected. Let me go ahead and show you the video. Well, I can't show you the video necessarily, but I can show you the image. Uh, if you want to go check this out, you can go to Dom, you can go to his um, um, Twitter and you can check it out. I can't play the video for the sound and obviously it's, it, it will look weird but just know that at the very bottom right you can see one of the island boys giving a oral job for lack of a better word to his brother right and it is clear it is all there really happening and so um i was saying that i thought this was publicity and i thought it was a joke um but now that i really looked into it these boys are disturbing something's going on there something's going on with them um, I don't know what's these celebrities we're obviously we get to see a lot more of celebrities. I wouldn't call these guys celebrities, but we're starting to see a lot more with celebrities. We're starting to see a lot more with stories coming out. People are speaking up. I think the line between what used to be being famous and just being a regular person, that line is so close now because of TikTok and all that kind of stuff. Anybody can blow up. Anybody can start making money off the internet. That it's just it's starting to get closer and closer. So you're starting to see more normal people calling out this kind of stuff. And honestly, I thought that with the Island Boys, I thought that what they were doing was just to promote their OnlyFans to make more money. But now it's gone a little off the deep end to me. I think that what they're doing is awfully disturbing. Um, and it is just to get their name out there. But to me... What are they trying to get their name out there for at this point? At this point, it doesn't make any more sense to me. To me, it's just like they're trying to, um, I don't even know what they're trying to do. I'm being honest. At this point, I think it's just disturbing. Something's going on with them in their head that they would feel like they need to go this far to even promote themselves because this is not good. This is very much incest of uh, doing stuff with your brother to this degree. And obviously, with incest, something has to be going on in your head. I mean, what is going on? And I know these one of these young men, at least for sure, has a uh, is a, has a mother, right? The mother of the child. I'm not sure if they're still together now. But as far as I know, they are together. They still make videos together. I see it on a TikTok. So this is a dad, a father of a young child making content like this. Obviously, the OnlyFans was already a problem. But this is even further, like to think about the child and think about the family saying that, oh, you know, I used to, I, I was completely wrong. I apologize that I even tried to give these guys any kind of lead way saying that this was just for their OnlyFans, which I'm against OnlyFans anyway, but I was saying it's for publicity. But now people have made it for sure, have for sure dug into this. And now we know it is awfully disturbing what these young men are doing. Very much so. You know, I want to take this back right quick. To so we all remember the story came out with Ray J and Car uh, Kim Kardashian about the tape that they made, right? And that the mother was in on it. Uh, in fact, she was there <laughs> doing all this, and she was she was uh, part of the contract to put it together. And this is what bursted Kim in onto the scene. This world of incest and this. Famous celebrity, famous TikTok, famous world. The incest that's going on and the morality that's breaking down is a true problem. And I don't think people really want to see it. People don't want to acknowledge it. I tell you guys again and again, the most dangerous people I believe are the people, the da most dangerous people I believe there are, are the people who just don't stand on anything. They don't stand on anything because those are the people that is harder for us to fight against because they just go with the wind. They think everybody should just be free or they just flat out don't care. They don't stand for anything. And the problem with that is it allows stuff like this to keep going on. 
This allows people to start thinking this stuff is normal. Having sexual relations with your twin brother, having this happen with your own mother. You have mothers and daughters doing OnlyFans together. And people are just so caught up in it's just getting to the money. It's just making money. It's all about getting money. And that sex is supposed to be this free enterprise when it's really destroying our country, as y'all can see clearly. But people just don't want to look into it because they just don't want to feel bad for any decisions they make. People are cowards these days. And I don't say it like uh, I don't mean it. I don't mean it like disrespectfully. I'm just that is a fact. People are too cowardly to even speak up against this because of whatever reason. They just want to stay out of the way. You, guys, stop looking past this. This is a real issue. We have celebrities sleeping with each other and their own family members. This is not just the island, boys. We clearly know that. This is going on everywhere. And we try to turn a blind eye to it like we can't see it. But it's really going on. Let me know what you guys think, man. What is the purpose of these? what these boys are doing? I think it's just them being disturbing. And it's gone a lot further than just trying to get some publicity. But maybe I'm wrong. Let me know what you think. Goodbye.